Tappers, today we check out the awesome Spark Amp and App by Positive Grid. I have to say, this thing has absolutely blown me away. It's not just another practice amp, it's a whole new beast. Combining their Spark App and the Spark Amp, they have some impressive smart functions. Not only is this a practice tool for electric guitar players, bass players and acoustic players can also use it. As you can see up here, you have an acoustic setting, a bass setting. Now, I've actually synced this up with their Spark app. It's all connected via Bluetooth. It's super easy, as you would have seen at the beginning of this video. And if you notice here on the screen, when I click through all the settings on here, it changes on here. How cool is that? I've not seen any other practice amps this high tech. You can change all the bass and you'll see that move on here. You can change the mids, the treble, the master, all of that good stuff. You can also turn your delay on and off. Look at that. <laughs> your reverb, got that. Basically, this acts as a normal amplifier. And by connecting your amp to this app, you get access to over 10,000 tones. 10,000! Their online cloud community is ever-growing. Anyone can upload. All of my tones from the beginning of this video are up there. If you search for Carl Golden, you should be able to find them. The Clapton tone. I've got Slash tone. There's a Van Halen tone. Uh, back to Clapton, what else we got? Dimebag Daryl tone, 
There's also a bass tone and also a Green Day tone. I absolutely love all the Bias FX plugins. I've got the latest one, Bias FX 2, on my computer, and it's so cool to get it in a format I can put into a little amp to practice with. The amp itself has a deep, loud, and immersive sound. They've obviously spent a lot of time making sure this sounds awesome, and it really does. It's 40 watts with stereo custom designed speakers. It's actually a very loud amp. You couldn't play it in a band setting or a live setting with a drummer, but you could take it to a practice where you're just all playing acoustically. As you heard at the beginning of this video through the medley, you can get so many different tones. I got some blues tones, some rock tones, some funk, metal. There are just so many options, it's insane. And that is why it is such an incredible tool for practicing. Let's have a look at the control panel. There's so many options on here. As you can see from the first knob, you can plug in an acoustic or a bass. Then we have different voicings for your electric guitar, so clean, glassy, crunch, high gain, and metal. This then gives you a rough preset to mess around with. Then you can move on to shaping your tone with the gain. You've got a bass and some mid, some treble, and the master volume. Everything that a normal amp would have. With the master volume, I always have that cranked up, but it depends on the kind of amp you want to use. Not only that, it's got modulation, delay, and reverb. You've also got a built-in tuner, so if you hold that down, that's now turned into a tuner. If I play my guitar, oh, that's in tune. That's a little out, but yeah, <laughs> you get the idea. You've got your tap tempo, and you also have four different presets here. So let's say you've got some settings you want to keep that you've made on the app. You can save that to either one, two, three, or four. So on number one, I've got the slash tone. Number two, I've got the dime bag tone. Three, Van Halen tone. Four, Clapton tone. So that's awesome. Once you've got your favorite presets, you can save them directly to the amp. So you don't have to have the app there. It should save that on there. You've also got a music volume knob where you control your auxiliary in or Bluetooth with the music volume control. And of course here you've got your headphones jack so you can plug in your headphones and play silently. If we quickly look at the back of this amp, you've got a power cable, you've got your aux in and you've got a USB input. As you would have seen at the beginning of this video, this can also be used as an audio interface. Now that is crazy. All I did to make this an interface was plug my USB into my Mac uh, my door Logic Pro X picked it up right away. I made that the input. Then I can record all my sounds directly into that. Here's something even more amazing. You don't have Logic Pro X? Don't even worry. PreSonus Studio One software comes free when you buy this. So you get a DAW free with it. You get audio interface and a practice amp that gives you over 10,000 tones combined with their app. Now. That's a practice amp. Come on, that is a practice amp. <laughs> Mental. Let me show you how easy it is to find a tone on here. So let's go to the cloud and let's find, I don't know, slash tone. Or just search for slash. And here we go. There's already loads of options there for you. Look at that. Let's try Bon Jovi. There you go, Bon Jovi. How about Oasis? There's one Oasis one. But there's just some examples of finding some tones. And what you can do is say you like this Oasis one, you can click that. Uh, let's go back. And it's there. And now what you can do is you can edit this sound to how you like it. So if you kind of like that tone, but you want to change, I don't know, the modulation, if you click that. I don't want a tremolo, let's double click. Maybe you want a chorus, you can add a chorus in. You can add a flangier, a phaser, vibrato, univibe. What about delay? Double click on delay. There's loads of different delays. Double click on the reverb. There's loads of different reverbs. Double click on the drive. There's loads of different drive. Comp, loads of different compressors. There's one noise gate. Loads of different amps here. 
as you can see, the options on this are endless. There are other amazing features like Smart Jam. The app basically listens to your playing, the feel, the timing, and creates a drum beat and a bass line that you can play over. What the hell? That's crazy. It's basically a smart virtual band. So let me grab a guitar. Okay, so if we click this little microphone button, we want them to play drums. So it's done it, here we go. You can also use it to practice along to backing tracks or your favourite songs. Good job, Positive Grid. That's it for today guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you check out the amp, I'll leave all links in the description. I'll see you for another video very soon. Take care man.